guys. Whoa, my camera just flipped out. We are back here in my lovely office in good old Fort Worth, Texas. And we are here today to do a reaction video that you guys have probably been waiting for because wait, did I have one yesterday? I have, wait, yesterday was Wednesday. Is today Thursday? Yesterday was Wednesday. So I didn't have one yesterday. I had one Tuesday. Took a little bit of a break. I had massive, massive jet lag. I'm not kidding. Like I slept for 12 hours. I'm feeling a little bit better today. Kind of nauseated. I don't know why, but I'm very nauseated today. But anyway, there's a new iPhone, about three new iPhones. I only care to react to one because there's like the new iPhone 8 coming out. I feel like the iPhone 8 is going to be like my iPhone 7. I hate that they come out with them so quickly and then I have to sit here and be like, oh, well, I have the iPhone 7 and it's just like, oh, you're so out of date now. You're just stupid. But today they have something called the iPhone X. Now I was on the plane when they were doing the whole Apple show for this. So I didn't get to see what it looks like. I didn't get to see the video for it. I saw nothing. So I want to react to the video that Apple has for it today. Um, apparently the only thing I saw is it has a face ID and like somehow the face ID didn't work, but we're going to take a look at it. It's number nine on trending. So it's huge in the first place. Let me get it loaded here. We're in HD. Everything is fine. Now guys, we're like almost at 175,000 subs. You guys are awesome. If you haven't subbed yet, go ahead and hit that subscription button. Turn the notifications on. Otherwise you're never going to see my videos or any of the reactions. And you guys seem to love this anyway. So let's get started with this video. It is the iPhone X introducing iPhone X. Apple video, let's go. Whoa, For more the music. Than a decade, oh, whoa. Our intention has been to create an iPhone that is all with display. Oh, stop right there. So what they're trying to say is they want to get rid of the button. Whoa, what do I got going on here, by the way? Look at this rainbow. Oh, Harry's put a tweet out about a rainbow. Okay, let's keep going. Physical <laughs> object that disappears into the experience. Okay. This music, by the way, is like nearly putting me to sleep. All right, don't do this, don't do this. This is iPhone 10. Oh, what? Hold on, what? Developing the form and display together defines a whole new integration. Oh my God. Making a boundary between the device and the screen. Wait, did they call it iPhone 10? I was calling it iPhone X, it's iPhone 10. What happened to iPhone 9? What the heck happened to iPhone 9? Wait, there's an 8, there's an 8 plus, and then there's a 10? You're just gonna skip out on 9? Not to discern. The custom OLED panel was engineered to fold and seamlessly combine the inside with the of that look at it. Oh my god! Mechanical buttons give way to touch and gestures. What? There's no home button. A single swipe takes you to the home screen. Wait, but what if it's locked? What do you do if it's locked? You go swipe to the That's weird because you know it's already hard enough for me, like when I'm swiping. Let me just get into my phone really quick. You might have just saw my thing. I'm sorry if you just saw my thing. Okay, so when I'm trying, oh, that's a chimp right there. When I'm trying to swipe, okay, it's fine there, but a lot of times I have problems swiping up and down, like it just goes all over the place. I don't know if I like that. I don't like the idea. Okay. The more responsive touch system uh -huh. means the gestures in iOS 11 are more fluid. iOS 11, how many? Every time they update the iOS, the it makes me so steel mad. The band reinforces the water resistant all glass design. Yo, wait a minute. Glass was the the wait. formulation the most durable ever in a smartphone enables for the first time wireless charging oh wireless charging that little wireless <gasps> that is huge that is needed because i get so look at this brick i carry around look at that i carry around and charge my phone like come on i hate the freaking earbuds though like the airpods are so stupid you can't use them with anything else i feel like and it's just obnoxious to me all right, keep it going. Show me Our something. Our new true depth camera system uh -huh. contained within this tiny space oh, it's uses little. extraordinary depth sensing technology oh, does so it? that you unlock your phone with a glance. Wait, what? Is this the eye thing? Wait, unlock it. Is it looking? Her face is wet. That's not, nah, -uh, that's not. We call this face ID. Uh, so it stupid. maps the unique geometry of your face with over 30,000 invisible dots. Hold on, question. One, what if you're a twin? Does that mean your twin's gonna be getting your phone, reading your text when you're talking crap about them? Two, what if you like age within a couple of years or what if something happens to you? All right, let's go. This data is analyzed by the neural engine on the A11 Bionic chip. What if you get your nose done? You know there's some YouTubers out there that have got their nose done. What if you get your nose done? Okay, the I'm just gonna stop. It's kind. Okay. Your iPhone now recognizes, recognizes you. you. Even in the dark, and will adapt to your physical changes. Will it adapt to my physical changes though? That's what I'm curious because this I'm pretty sure that it doesn't adapt to my thumbprint when it's wet sometimes. I'm just saying. Makes your face your secure password. So with just a look, you can authenticate your phone or use Apple Pay. What if someone ripped your face off? Like 
making the movies so that they can use your Apple Pay. You get killed and they tear your... Oh, it's gonna happen a lot, guys. The True Depth camera also enables new experience. Whoa, that's sick. Like bringing emojis to life. Oh. more than 50 facial muscles in real time. I might be sitting there talking to people. I'm gonna be sending people texts. I'm gonna be like a unicorn, like, hey, Tinny, how's it going today? And it's gonna so be me as a unicorn. Oh, sad. Oh, the poop face. Cross. Front and rear facing cameras now have portrait mode. Oh, that's and better. I don't even have portrait mode. Actually, the light in a scene. Oh, Based on fundamental photographic principles, portrait lighting produces the effect of real studio light. I'm about to become a model with my iPhone. I'm gonna make it look like model esque. Wait for it. Wait for it. On look the, the camera, the dual camera system is completely redesigned. It's made even oh, smarter God. by the A11 Bionic chip. Hey, how many of us know what an A11 Bionic chip is? Because I don't! With machine learning, it's not gonna uh -uh. detects elements in the scene to it won't be waterproof. the image before the photo is even taken. You're gonna, you put that in there, you're not gonna be able, your, your little touch, like, charger thing's not gonna work. Like, my charger, when it gets wet, this supposed to be, like, kind of water resistant? No. The camera we use now every the... day now delivers so, so much, much more. more. What? And as iOS becomes the world's largest platform for augmented reality. Are you gonna put a dinosaur in the middle of the basketball court? Come it on. We define what's possible. Oh my this god. Is iPhone 10. I called it iPhone X. What was I stupid? Holy crap. I mean, it kind of looks like it's worth it, but oh my god. Okay, that phone, minus some features that I feel like are gonna end up having some problems, that phone looked pretty amazing. Like, I'm gonna, once people get that, I'm gonna feel like I'm so out of date with this little old iPhone 7 that I have to sit in there. So it's not even like an actual button, it's that like weird, well it is a button, but it's a different click or whatever. And I'm gonna feel like it's just gonna be so old now. It's gonna be so, I'm gonna have to do it. What I'm gonna do is I'm going to, I wonder if I could trade this phone in. Maybe I'll trade, I, because I pay cash for my phones. I don't do any of this stuff, so I pay cash for them. So maybe i trade the phone in, and then I get that. I'm actually really disappointed. I bet Dubious too, because he just got the 7 Plus, because his phone was like broken, shattered. But that is exciting, guys. I want to know, what do you guys think about the iPhone 10? Are you going to go for the 8? Like, why would you even go for an 8 or an 8 Plus if there's a 10 out there? I don't understand why anyone would make that decision, but what do you guys think of it? Um, I heard, I didn't get to see it here, I thought they'd show me where they tried the face ID on stage and it didn't work. Do you guys think that's gonna work? Let me know that in the comments down below. That's my reaction to the iPhone 10, guys, which I called the iPhone X at the beginning. Hope you guys enjoyed this reaction video. If you did, smash that thumbs up button, and until next time, see you guys later.